Science of the Seventh Dawn, the Saviors of Eorzea, and blah 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 etc. If you clicked on this video, you most likely know who they are. But who they are is actually not important at all, for it is their drip which will be ranked today. But this intro is already way too long, let me stop talking and start speaking. Number 9. Cryo. You know it, I know it. This drip ain't it. The colors are kinda cute, the cat ears are nice, but these Baldessian pajamas don't really hold up to be placed anywhere above the bottom. Number 8. Graha Tear. I can already hear the angry screams of Graha's Twitter simps cursing me to the depths of hell itself, but I'm sorry, Lil Bro looks like every single one of those people who post their street fashion outfits and it's literally the same thing every single time. Like, he is over 300 years old at this point. He had all that time to learn fashion and this is all he could come up with. Massive L. Number 7. Estinian. Now, you may say he's just wearing some armor, and I agree, but the armor fits him kinda well though. Plus, unlike most of these motherfuckers, he actually wears that pink shirt Vegeta looking ass outfit when he's not estinianing, which gives him extra points, I'm on. Number 6. The Drip Maestro herself. Tataru. Motherfucking Taru. Unfortunately though, Tataru is a very poetical character, for she leads others to a treasure she cannot possess, making Drip for the Scions, and for the Warriors of Light, and for literally everyone at this point. Don't get me wrong, the tower has the highest amount of unique outfits worn out of all the characters in this game, and it's not even close, but a lot of the time they are quite simple and don't have that special sauce to put her into the top 5. Now that all these Goombas are out of the way, it's time to move on to the Koopas, the shell and potato of the list. Number 5. Alfie No. What can I say except clean? He's got the belt, he's got the Bones, he's got the chains, all for no real reason except drip. The four-way split cape is peak, and it's well fitted and matches his vibe and elevates it to new heights. Number four. Yestola. The tired and makeshift look was initially a bit of a turn off for me, but after spending some time analyzing the science drip, it low key grew on me. It gives a bit of a uniqueness to separate from the others, and my favorite part is obviously the layering on the dress with different forms and stitch variations, creating a really cool and like deliberate look despite the initial makeshift appearance. TLDR, she do be rocking that dress like an absolute girl boss. And listen, the only thing I rate higher than a woman slaying a dress is a man slaying a dress. Number three, Oriange. Another one that had to grow on me, and grow on me it did. The dress itself is relatively simple, and my man kills it, but the jewelry, the unfathomable amount of ice that my brother is carrying, really adds the detail that his drip needed. He is quite literally dripping in enough sauce to have a lifetime supply of bolognese. Number 2. Alize. Girl really pulled up with that red, white, two-toned, full leather, cool ass looking outfit and thought we wasn't gonna notice or something. She got them random belts for no reason, she got them pieces of play armor for no reason cause that shit ain't protecting you from nothing, it's just there for drip. I don't know what to say, well I do but it will double the length of this video so I just won't. Just, just have a look. Plus it perfectly fits her personality which is always a plus. And finally, at number one, we have Mr. I can take care of a plant because Thancred was. He's got body armor mixed with a sick ass overcoat, the classic belt for no reason except drip, a bunch of accessory to let these hoes know, and my guy is rocking that choker like he gets tier 3 subs on Twitch for licking a mic. Don't get me started on how he just carries that cartridge down like that letting you know not to mess around. Too badass for no reason. List is done, if I didn't add your favorite sign, there's a reason for that goofy. If you think that my objective list is not correct, then you can PayPal me to delete the video. I will do it. Subscribe or I will release another video. Do not test me.